Amber Bridge. And I'm Jason Marshall. Welcome to Think, Make, Innovate, our makerspace show. <laughs> nice shirt. Awkward. So, what are you working on here? I'm actually working on my March Madness Little Bits Challenge. Little Bits? I'm not familiar with those. Uh, what are they all about? Hmm, let's see. What would be the best way to describe what Little Bits are? What are Little Bits? So, I think Little Bits um, are just a fun circuit that you can make lots of things with, um, with just lots of different tools that are fun. Little Bits are things that like they're machines but there's not really a limit to like what you can make and what you can't make and you can combine the light sound movement you can pretty much make whatever you want with it wow electricity sounds dangerous i think that the basic design of little bits was made so kids can create circuits without getting electrocuted or hurt for this month's challenge, we were able to work with fourth grade students at Washington Elementary in Mount Vernon. The students had been using little bits during their makerspace time in the media center. Um, I've made an alarm clock. That's my favorite one. Um, I have. We've tried to make a doorbell before. Um, we've made. Um, we started a flashlight, and I've made. Um, just like little things that make sound. I have used them to make lights, buzzers, and different stuff using circuits. Little bits are actually small pieces that magnetically connect together to create a functioning circuit. And they can be combined in a million different ways to help fuel their imagination and your imagination. Components included in each kit include buzzers, lights, motors, switches, and sensors. When we went out to Washington Elementary, the students were building celebration machines to use when their favorite team scored a basket or wins a game. Ah, it's March Madness, perfect timing. The students there participated in a maker cycle where they worked in groups to actually plan out their designs of how they're gonna connect the little bits to create their celebration machine. They used an app called Explain Everything to capture that process. Not only their drawings, but it also it recorded their voices as they explained their designs. They then put their plans in action. Check out their creativity with their Little Bits celebration machines. We hope that you enjoy, and we encourage you to try out Little Bits to create your own celebration machine. And if you do, we would love to see what you make and add you to our online maker community. And as always, have, have fun, fun making! making. Um, so we're actually going to make two projects. Um, one is going to have the multicolored light with a buzzer and then a, the string of light. Um, and then it's going to light up a sign that says yay. And then we're also going to have like a windmill and a buzzer and some lights on our second project. A disco ball. A disco ball. Oh, sweet. Is it going to like spin or anything? Yeah, or? it'll like spin. Yeah, exactly. Hold it like this, and then we're gonna put shine the light inside of it. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Okay. And how are you gonna trigger that? You're just gonna push the button, or are you gonna have it do something? We're gonna push the push button. Push the button, have it spin. I like it. Do like a loop, and then. Yeah, we could do a battery behind there. Then we're gonna have the backboard out of like cardboard. And we're gonna have some lights to make it all fun. Right here. And we're gonna put some colors around it. So it's all great. Maybe we could have a hoop and then we could have a little propeller on it. Hoop that you go up the wall and see if it goes in. Like a basketball hoop, but we and then we throw the a ball, ball into goes that. in here and, and then, then it makes pushes the sound the buzzer and like light. Yeah. What do you use with your basketball? That's a good question. A bouncy ball. Like a bouncy ball? Okay. All right. Okay, I'll look for something. We are working on a basket 
ball hoop. Ball hoop. With a buzzer on the bottom, where well a button, a button, whatever. <laughs> where a a bouncy ball, or just another ball, or then, any ball, yeah, will go in. goes in, hits the buzzer, hits the, bu <laughs> hits the button, sets off the buzzer, buzzer, and lights flash, and lights, lights appear flash. Keep it on the high one. Then we can turn it off. Here. Here. Then. Okay, Jack, see the wood. Just make a little hole so it. Like this. Oh, oh, so the buzzer doesn't work. Okay, after. So, like, I turn it off. What's it getting caught on? The tape motor. It's getting caught on the motor? Do we not have enough? Um, <laughs> Definitely, but... <laughs> you were like, 